barbecue action here at Royal Hibachi Buffet Route 46 West Saddlebrook, New Jersey Commodore Jeff Sambello The Vapors of Life Look at that Look at that beef the Spices, the aroma hey, Here we go The done deal And we got a little lo mein over there I think I think I see some shrimp I don't know Maybe I'm, I'm seeing a mirage from the heat and vapors. Even though it's freezing out here on Black Friday 2018, the people out in, in this mall area are insane. The traffic is insane, so I park farther away because I'm not too lazy to walk. I'm not going to deal with these crazy people, these retail shoppers. So uh, there we go. I just arrived here, actually. Uh, let me see what they have here. I can always come back later to this. Oh, we got, hey, wait a minute. We got new, we got new, uh, oh, look at all that succulent shrimp, man. King Kong Camarones. Oh, look at that. Domino Chef's Day. Chef's Day Look at that, look at that. Vapors of life indeed. Very crowded here. Black Friday. Very crowded. Look at that. Alright. Well, I'm sure there will be lots of Mongolian barbecue action here. Let me see what they have here. Oh my god, look at that. We got the we got the cock dribble uh, special over there. We got one big whiting left. We got um, uh, clams, I guess mussels, shrimp, uh, calamari, marinara. What's this? Beef stew. You know what? Let me get a plate. Let's see if I get. I don't think I'll get yelled at because there's a big spoon in there. Commodore. Oh, look at this toiki. Turkey without, you know what? Turkey without the lectures. Without the lectures from relatives. I think. You know Turkey without the lectures. There we go. I don't know if it's going to be dry, but. I'll give it a shot. I'm gonna have to. They got gravy here. No. I'm gonna have to put. I'm gonna have to put the drippings on there. Cause I don't see any spoon. I don't see no damn spoon here. How am I gonna do this? Uh, oh, forget it. It's like trying to break apart a dinosaur. <laughs> pterodactyl. It's a pterodactyl from the Flintstones. <laughs> yeah, you know what? Considering I had to listen to obnoxious relatives yesterday, this I'm in peace now. I'm in peace. And the turkey is in pieces. I'm gonna need a steak knife though. What do we got here? Smashed potatoes. Uh, mac and cheese. Two kinds of mac and cheese. Uh, I don't know. Maybe I'll get some spinach. Spinach or, or gratin. Oh, God. All right, so. Uh, that's good. All right. Let me look around and see if there's any gravy. I can always have... Look at the size of that calamari, Jeff Sambello. I can always come back to the fish. Oh, look at this. What are those? Onions and potatoes left and all the beef is gone in the beef stew. How about that? I saw some uh, unsupervised young children by the iScream station. 
Yes, uh, yes indeed. Unsupervised. Unstupidvised. Not now, but before I saw it. I scream. Alright, let me see if there's any kind of gravy here. Maybe I'm missing something. No. I don't know. You know what? I'm gonna need moisture. Look, look what I'm doing. Look what I'm using for a spoon. I'm using tongs. Because I got no choice, man. I have no, I have no stinking choice. Look at that. Look at that Commodore. Look at that. No one here will antagonize me, get under my skin, push my buttons, try to start political arguments with me. Oh, I am in peace. And this is James P. Madonna's Progressive Discussions Thanksgiving. Well, the day after Black Friday Thanksgiving dinner. And uh, I just wish I had a had some kind of a spoon. But damn, I'm gonna scoop up these drippings. You know how. You know how dry turkey breast can be. Uh, you know what? So losing, you know what I should do? I got an idea. Why am I killing myself? Let me go get a dessert spoon. And then, over by the ice cream, see? Get a dessert spoon. And then, I'll scoop my drippings. I'll take the spoon back to the table. And that's it. It'll be a done deal. Ah, oh, there's a party going on in there. Hold on. Oh. Come on. Got a, got a party going on in there in the party room. Isn't that something? The Turkish lamps. Uh, Murphy's. Hold on. What? There you go. There you go. This is the only way to fly. Get the nice strippings going in. All right, back to the table. Back to the table. I'm all set. I just need a steak knife. Hey, what happened? No steak knives? I'm in trouble now. I need a steak knife. I'm gonna have to ask somebody for a steak knife. How am I gonna cut this? How am I going to cut this? I'm going to have to get a steak knife. There you go, Commodore Jeff Zambello. Lots of unsupervised young children at the ice cream station, of course, just like I predicted. We got some real busy Mongolian barbecue action going on here. Look at all this. Oh my god, this is like, like a carnival. It's a gastronomic carnival. Wow, look at the vapors of life kicking up. All those spices. Beautiful. You got every kind of food you can think of. Vegetables. Shrimp. Uh, beef. Uh, I don't think that was, that's lamb. I, I wish they had lamb. I think that's beef. 
Maybe there's chicken there also. Hey, there we got a finished product right there. We got a beautiful. The king of Mongolian barbecue, Commodore Jeff Sambello, on this Black Friday 2018 uh, Royal Hibachi Buffet, New 46 West, Saddle Brook, New Jersey. All right. Oh, the guy left out the shrimp. He got fell off his dish. The guy got gypped out of a shrimp. Don't crimp the shrimp, Commodore Jeff Sambello. Don't crimp it. I got that from Sanford and Son. Don't crimp. Don't you crimp that shrimp. Oh, the shrimp got thrown out. I wouldn't have done that. There's nothing wrong with that shrimp. Hey, look at, look at all this action, man. This guy is like the... He's like the Benny, like the old Benny Han of Tokyo, you know, the acrobatics. This guy's all over the place. Look at this. Oh, look at that. Beautiful, beautiful. Here comes the sauce. Here come I wonder what that is. It's got an orangey look to it, but I guess it's an oil blend of some kind. I don't know. The bottle is yellow. of the show, aside from me having my turkey dinner in peace, is Mongolian barbecue. Black Friday Mongolian barbecue action. Circus Maximus. Wow, this is heavenly. This is heavenly. This is the ultimate Mongolian barbecue video. Not just because James P. Madonna is filming it, but it's Black Friday Mongolian barbecue, high intensity action, second to none. Second to none. Here we go. Oh, here's the finished product. Hey, here's more. Another finished product. This guy, this guy doesn't miss a trick. Look at that. He's great. Look at him. He knows what. You know, look. Everybody's got. Look at this. New, there's new, there's new, pro, new, new raw plates ready to be cooked. Unbelievable. I can't even keep up with all this action. Beautiful. Look at this. Look, 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 look. look. Oh, this is great. Okay. Okay, now it's time to take care of myself. Uh, hopefully, the beef is tender in the beef stew. It's kind of well done, but the gravy, hopefully the gravy will make up for it. But I don't know that. I don't know if those are onions or potatoes. 
I don't want, I don't want any white potatoes, man. That's peasant food. That's cheap ass peasant food. It's okay for the, for the Irish when they were starving over there, in England. I mean, in uh, in Ireland, under British rule, but. It's, not good for old James P. Madonna, that's for damn sure. Now, let me get a little of this, this, this cock dribble. Got some calamari. Calamari and shrimp and marinara. Uh, I know what's going to happen. I'm going to take the clam. The clam shells are going to take up all the all the space of my plate because I got what do you call it? I got the let me grab some of the black mussels yeah let me get some of the black mussels what the hell is this All right, that's what I had last time. All right, this will be my surf and turf, even though the brown gravy will be commingling with the uh, marinara sauce, unfortunately. I have no, I have no choice in that. Maybe uh, on my next trip, I'll grab a whiting. I mean, no, you know what? The hell with the what? Hell with the whiting. Whiting's not bad, especially if they're fresh whiting. Salmon, salmon steaks usually are much moister with higher fat and omega three than the uh, salmon fillets. So it's really a toss up. Do I want the white fish of whiting? The white supremacist whiting fish. Or do I want to go with healthy, with I mean heart healthy omega threes with the salmon fillet. But all the seafood here is fresh. All right. I will head back to the table. Oh, the crowd is clearing out. I squeeze my limes in the drink already. There we go. It's a very, very soppy dish, but it should do. Young children completely out of control in a restaurant. No discipline, probably spoiled and coddled. <laughs> WC Fields, where are you when we need you? Also Krampus. I just got off my seat and I'm walking by the ice cream station, and look what I find. The, the, the young mothers with the young children, look what they did. They left the door of the ice cream station wide open. Commodore Jeff Sambello, this is no exaggeration. Here you have the trickle dickle of the cock dribble, right? Look at this, they left it wide open. Unbelievable. I will do my good deed. Unbelievable. I can't believe it. I can't believe America's modern day parenting nowadays, you know? Let's see what we got here. Nothing does surprise me, to be honest with you. Oh, wow. The salmon sure disappeared, but I can always have salmon. Um, the whiting, I'm not, I'm not really in a whiting mood. I don't know. Let's see what's over here. 
potato soup? Nah, peasant food. Peasant, peasants. Look that Mongolian barbecue action, Royal Abachi Buffet, Route 46 West, Saddlebrook, New Jersey. Uh, it's starting to taper down here. It's not as busy as it was before. But this guy has been going non-stop. This guy's doing a great job. He's doing a great job. And we got a new, we got a new plate of lo mein waiting to be uh, cooked up. It's scraping the grill, of course. Getting set up for a new plate. Some lo mein noodles. There we got lo mein noodles and I'm not sure what that is. A pork chop or I don't know. It's hard to say. Look, there's a piece of meat next to the lo mein noodles that look like a pork chop, but I could be wrong. I know it's not chicken, it's not lamb. Might be pork. See, when they're frozen, it's hard for me to tell. It could be either beef or pork. Everybody just, they just walked away. Everybody walked away. What's going on here? What, what do they do? They left. They leave the food. They leave the food. You you you're working hard non-stop. Non-stop. Boom 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 boom. And they just walk away. What's going on here? Whoa. Where's that pork or beef? That's no, beef. That's beef. Oh beef, okay. They don't have no uh, lechon or carnitas or no. ch chicharron or nothing. <laughs> no pal? No pal. You know no pal? Oh, no. The cactus? I like that. Yeah? Yeah. En enchilada suiza with yeah. tomatillo. All right. That's beef. Look at what I found. They left the scooper in the chocolate chip mint. Look at, that, look at that mess. And they actually left the door open before, but you, I already got that on video. Um, I'm waiting for the spoons. Actually, hold on. You know what? Before, before I get my hands all messed up. Oh, dear. Let me just get my ice cream. It's not too hard, it's not too soft. Chocolate. I'm just in a mood for chocolate, that's it. Get some chocolate. I scream. I get it so I don't get a bellyache. It's a conservative uh, portion. <laughs> 